stuff, okay? Um, so very quickly, the word for fish? Yes. Yes. Uh, word for water? Ishka. Word for salt? Solemn. Yeah, the big difference on pronunciation there, in the west and north it's more solemn, and in the south it's salon. So the stress is different. The word for big? More. 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 And the word for small? Yog. Yog or beg, however you prefer. Um, I don't like fish. Ni malyom ies. So not good with me fish. Ni malyom ies. Um, I love ice cream. Is kralyom. So his kralyom is great with me. Is great with me cream frozen. <laughs> okay. Um, where's your dog? How will your mother? How will the water? What's the water? Okay, how will the wadra? Madra is dog, but the wadra is your dog. Okay. Um, I have a black cat. Page three, okay. So ka agam means I have, kat du is cat black. So ta kat du agam or kat do. Okay. And do you have potatoes? Will Pratiaga. Uh, will Pratiaga. They just handed me. It's like a Prati, right? They just. <laughs> 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 it's the AI, right? Yeah, Prati. Yeah. Okay. I don't know what's what. I don't have to. Okay, there should be three pages. Uh, make sure no one has a stack <laughs> sitting under yeah, next to them. Or... Oh, here's page one. Here you want to Yeah. Okay. Anyone missing anyone? Yeah. There, I can get them around. <laughs> See, there's a two here, so they got around somewhere. <laughs> okay. Here are pages two and three. Three. I need to arrange the chairs differently. <laughs> okay. Um, everyone has one. I think I'm getting two. One, two, and three. You need two? Yeah, and three. There's two. And. Are you there? Can you make your lesson tiny? I want to page. So it has to get around, doesn't it? <laughs> Alright. Everyone has three pages. Alright. So, any questions on the words? Um, the thing I noticed is probably the biggest stumbling block on all of these expressions I've been throwing at you is the having something, okay? Yeah. And uh, we're going to do a little bit more with that. So, um, we actually have it on this lesson, so we'll get it again. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so, um, Cast the Shea, Lesson 6, Lachana Fahain, page 1. Kishvarga, which means by the sea. Kishvarga. Okay. Um, so it starts off, Kui and Klan Kishvarga. So, Kui and Klan Kishvarga. So, Kui and Klan Kishvarga. So, Kui is went. Okay, and that's one of those irregular ones in Irish that changes all over the place. But, Kui, went. Kui. So, if you say, I, how would you say, I went? Hui me. So hui me wherever you went, okay? Um, and Juan is the the family, um, in this case the kids, okay? I probably should have put the, the kids there, it might have been a better translation in this case. Um, Juan is sort of, uh, yeah, kids maybe is a better, it's, it's, yeah, Pashti would be kids, Klan would be kids from the same family, so, yeah, family terms in English and Irish don't really match up that well, so. Um, but yeah, kids might be a better reading of that. Um, and then, and 
Kishvarge um, means literally by the sea. Okay? Um, it comes from the word kos, which means foot, and so it's the idea of, I guess, standing by the sea or something like that. But kush, kush farage, that's the expression you want to get down, means by the sea. Okay? So you'll see those two words together a lot. Okay? It's kind of like we have Fuin Pua is in the country, kush farage is by the sea. Okay? Living in San Diego is probably a good expression to know, because you live kush farage. Okay? Um, one of the, if any of you have done Michal O'Shiel's book on Irish, um, the dialect that in there is actually called Kusharige, which is a variant of this, and it's a dialect from, uh, it's an area between, uh, kind of headed west from Galway along the strand there, and it's a region of Connemara, and that's the dialect that's in there. There's, there's another one, that I've got a lingua on record, and, well, and these people are from Connacht there, County Mayo. Yeah. County and, and Mayo. And they call it Krishna Farage. Yeah, Krishna Farage. So, variants, variant ways of saying it. Okay? So, Huyen Plan Krishna Okay, So, they went to the sea. Meaning, like, to the beach. Okay? Um, it says, number two, Vina Sluichaan and La Shin. Vina Sluichaan and La Shin. So there were crowds of people there that day, and I'll explain the expression in a second. First of all, the word slua means a crowd, so unslua is the crowd, and the plural sluicha, so nasluicha are the crowds. Nasluicha. Okay? And the word for day in Irish is unla. And you want to say that day is unla shin. And this day would be unla sho. Okay? So in Irish, what you're really saying is, the, the crowds were there that day, okay? So V is where Nesluich of the crowds, on means there, on La Shin that day. So the crowds were there that day is what you say in Irish, you say there were crowds there that day. Okay, V Nesluich on and La Shin. V Nesluich on and La Shin. Okay. Give him a test. Okay, here you go. There's three papers in there. And, yeah, and then you can maybe put the rest of them on the steps or something. Okay. Oh, <laughs> actually, we might need it back here. <laughs> okay. Get in there. <laughs> All right. Just something to look on for a second. Oh, well, I've got the first one. I didn't okay. See All right. So, Vina Sucha on and Lashi, and the crowds were there that day, or was crowded. Okay. Um, number three. Vina Mra and Ali Fuingrian. Okay, so the women were lying down under the sun. Um, first of all, uh, the word for a woman, or the woman in Irish, is unvan. Unvan. Okay, or a woman just by itself is ban, and the woman unvan. And the plural is different. It's namra, or there's, there's actually two pronunciations for that. You can say namana, namana, or namra. Uh, a lot of times N is pronounced, depending on where you are, it's pronounced like an R uh, when it's next to another. Uh, you know, that's like Femina with a Fed Russia. Yeah. How would that so. be? Okay. Way back into your yeah. Name. Which way is it in the north? In the north, it's going to be Mana, I think. No. South, it's Mana. No. Um, some of the western ones, you have Mara. No. Yeah. Um, I think actually it's been Mana. It might actually be Mara. You know, I've been doing the Denigal stuff lately and I've <laughs> heard it. Uh, yeah. I'm trying to think if I've heard it in the Denigal accent. Yeah. Um, okay. Um, the other one, um, the word for sun is Grian. The sun, Angrian. And under the sun, Fuin Grian. Okay, so Fui means under, Fui is under the, and that sticks uh, Uru on the sun, so it becomes Fui Nguyen. It eclipses the sun. <laughs> okay. Eclipses the sun. Okay, Fui Nguyen. Okay. 